Progestin-only contraceptive pills, or the mini pill, are an effective contraceptive method. In the United States, mini pills that contain norgestrel and norethindrone are available. The most common brand names are Micronor and NorQD, though multiple generic formulations are also available. Pills with desogestrel, brand name of Cerazet, are available in Europe and parts of Latin America, but not in the United States. In the U.S., many pills are most commonly used in the postpartum period in breastfeeding moms. If taken correctly, many pills are over 99% effective. No one pill is better than another. Because of their short half-life, progestin-only pills need to be taken within three hours of the same time every day or within 27 hours of the previous pill, to be most effective. If a woman is more than three hours late in taking the pill, she should take it as soon as she remembers, while still taking the next day's pill at the prescribed time. She should also use backup contraception for 48 hours. Progestin-only pills should be taken daily. There is no pill-free interval with progestin-only pills. The only absolute contraindication for progestin-only pills is current breast cancer. Family history of breast cancer or thromboembolism are not contraindications to taking progestin-only pills. Relative contraindication to progestin-only pill use include active cirrhosis or viral hepatitis, previous history of breast cancer five or more years ago, active cardiovascular disease, migraines with aura, or concurrent ingestion of medications that induce liver enzymes. The main mechanism of action of traditional progestin-only pills is thickening of cervical mucus. Up to 50% of women will not ovulate when on progestin-only pills, but this is not a reliable mechanism for pregnancy prevention. The main side effect of progestin-only pills is abnormal vaginal bleeding. Up to 70% of women on progestin-only pills experience abnormal bleeding for at least one cycle, and 25% cite bleeding as a reason for discontinuation of pills. About half of all women on progestin-only pills will continue to have regular menstrual cycles, while about 20% will be amenorrheic, and the rest will have irregular bleeding patterns. There is no evidence of a difference in bleeding patterns between pills. Clinically, there is no evidence of benefit in bleeding patterns with higher doses of pills, addition of estrogen to the regimen, or changing pill formulations. There is no evidence of a causal relationship between progestin-only pills and weight gain, depression, or headaches. The pills can be started three weeks after delivery or at any time in the menstrual cycle for other women. If started after day five of the menstrual cycle, backup contraception should be used for 48 hours. Progestin-only pills are a good method of contraception for breastfeeding postpartum women or women over 35 who smoke and want to continue on an oral contraceptive pill, or who have other contraindications to taking estrogen-containing contraceptive pills.